It's uh, just going to be me. Seriously, guys, it's just me. I'm just kidding. Ali's right here. <laughs> Did we state then? All right. We got all ours from our favorite um, we wine have producer, right? Wine in a tin. Wine in a tin. <laughs> <laughs> Everything's tin. <laughs> like, we're not going to stop. Can't stop, one stop. Cheers. Cheers. Delicious mm. wine. That's good. That's like the red wine craving we've been having. Yeah. Okay. Um, it's important to have good wine in hand. At all times. At all times. I agree. Uh, mackerel, tuna belly, and the fancy, fancy. Yeah, the premium, premium. Esplanar mussels. So this is the one that Anthony Bourdain tried when he was in Spain, uh, when he was in Barcelona. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. <coughs> this is the exact tin. Did he like eat if, it? You, if you go back and look at one of the uh, videos of him, like you'll see that. Did he eat it just on a fork or on a potato dip? Uh, no, just... Uh, yeah, just yeah, he went for it. He's put it in his mouth. <laughs> you ready? Mm -hmm. Is that premium? Uh -huh. Yeah. <laughs> that sauce. Oh, <coughs> the sauce is really good. It's glistening, you know. So good. Oh, mm hmm. It's, it it's worth. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think with with that brand, the premium makes sense. Mm -hmm. It <clears throat> it's juicy. You know. Yeah. The muscles are juicy. Juicy. It's just like the the oil itself, the flavors in it have like a more rich, intense flavor too. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I mean, it's higher quality fish. Yeah, and you get the fish flavor in it. Mm. You know what? Was so good today. I think grapes are a great addition to the board. I mean, we did have nice grape one time, yeah. I'm gonna do Indian pickle with tuna belly. This wine hits the spot. I like it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So much flavor with the pickle. What should I try next? Um, oh, it's the tuna belly. I'm good. Well, I don't like it as much as the Donastia one, but it's very good. Yeah, I remember the Donastia tuna belly was so good. nice and um, fatty. Not. Not a, an intense flavor. Yeah. I think that, that's what it's missing. Mm. Mm -hmm. I think that would be good for like a, an actual recipe that you're making because it's got like good mm -hmm. oils. What kind of cheese is this? Look at our fancy little. I don't know. <laughs> fancy little. What do you call this? A cheese, cheese knife? There's probably a word for that specific thing. Yeah. I love a cheese knife. And you know the words for the cutlery. Let yeah, what is it called? Do you like the cheese? It's Calgary Creamery and <clears throat> hop along. It's washed in cider. It's got a very um, different mouthfeel. I like it. I like the mouthfeel mm -hmm. a lot. It's creamy, but still a hard cheese. And also mackerel. Oh, good fish. Mm. Good fish. It's just like a great basic mackerel. It's got a really nice flavor. It's not fishy, but it has that like meatiness. 
I'm always very critical of the mackerel. I grew up eating a lot of mackerel and, oh, well, fresh mackerel, but that doesn't, you know, mean that I, I mean, that doesn't mean anything. It just means that I've, you, you like I've had a lot of mackerel. Yeah, I agree. Very mild flavors. Mmm. Wait. Yeah, I can't with onion. Macro with onion? Fine onion. Excellent. It's biryani onion. Mm. Oh, by the way, this is biryani onion. It's fried biryani There's onion. There's a special type of onion. Only one person in the world who knows how to make it. No, I'm just kidding. That was good, huh? Mm -hmm. All right, fried onion, guys. Do it. <laughs> that was a great addition. Mackerel, fried onion, pickled all in there. Really good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's okay. Just a sip. Hmm. It's an open face sandwich. <laughs> yeah, it's like a full meal. It's a full meal. I'm gonna do a little cheese and bread intermission. Oops. Thank you, I have them all. <laughs> cheese. Maybe a grape. Grape chaser. Mm-hmm. 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 You like it? Mm-hmm. Cheese and bread is so good. Can't go wrong. Nope. Raining. What's your number one? Oh, the mussels. The premium mussels from Esclavnar. Your dream come true to try them? Yeah. I'm, I'm reliving my Anthony Bourdain days. I love Anthony Bourdain. Number two. Oh man, I think they're pretty equal, honestly. Oh really? Yeah. I like the mackerel more. Yeah. They're both on like very mild white fish kind of. Yeah, level. they provide a similar thing. Yeah. Um. Oh, and. A wise woman once said, <laughs> add chips on everything. Specifically your sandwich. <laughs> what a wise woman. How is it? Mm-hmm. Well good. Smart lady, that woman. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I agree. I just made an entire sandwich. The mackerel, arugula, pale jalapeno, and onion. <laughs> this is no longer a tinfish account. This is a sandwich account. We're coming for you, Salt, salt Hank. Hank. <laughs>